know who needs to hear this, but the threat of losing our basic freedoms and rights is a real threat. When governments and people in power take things away from their citizens, they don't want to give it back. Why would they give things back to you when they have control over you already? I've heard people just scoff of the idea of Canadians losing their freedoms and rights. It's like tyrannical governments and communism is just a fairy tale. Just think about it for a moment. Among many, my parents fled Poland to escape communism. I'm not talking about my grandparents or my great grandparents, and I'm not talking about some legend that was passed on as a caution tale. I'm talking about one generation ago. Just one generation ago, my parents did everything they could to escape the country they were in, and they escaped to Canada where they were supposed to be free. And of course, they had it good for a while, but now they're finding their own daughter fighting for the very same freedom that they came here for. The Soviet hammer and sickle flag was finally lowered in December 1991. That's only years before I was born. Really not that long ago. Even today, we have communist ruled countries. Cuba, Vietnam, China, North Korea, just to name a few. And I don't see Canadians fleeing to those countries. Where I do see Canadians fleeing to is places like Florida. Beautiful and free Florida where everyone is able to make their own choices and take as much risk as they want. To simplify things, freedom, good. Tyrannical Canadian government, bad. Very, very bad.